So this is the brand new Dorkin Fest Super Trunks. And today we're going to be trying him out. So he starts off as Super Saiyan Trunks. And then later on, we will get to see him into Super Trunks. Um, one thing about his stats is that he has under 10,000 defense at 100%, which I think is very low. Uh, 19,000 attack and 14,000 HP. We'll run double of him here with free-to-play units. So in this team, we have 333,000 HP. His leader skills Master Evolution Android Cell Saga for 170% and 3 key. If they are also in Rapid Growth or Warriors Race on Earth, they get the additional 30%. Uh, we are using this support memory to increase all of our stats for Android Cell Saga a super units for 15% attack and defense. So we should see the best stats that Trunks could possibly have on free to play. <laughs> Linky Barners. Now, a lot of this guy has restrictions versing Cell. So this is one of the hardest Cell stages in the whole entire game. Uh, this will be a good test of strength for him. He started turn defense is 256,000. He has a high chance to guard attacks here if you have um, three or more Android Cell Saga category allies on the team, which I think is super important for how low his defense is or starter turn defense is. Because he's taking 10,000 on the first phase. Um, he's got 8 million attack stat, which is fairly good. It's effective against all types because we are versing Cell. So that's awesome. Um, he gets an additional attack defense 70% when performing a super attack. So that does jump his defense quite a bit post super. So now he can tank double digit damage at least. Um, and then he gets starter turn attack defense 150% to key. 100% attack and defense and performs an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack. Again, with the um, three or more Android Cell Saga allies on the team, which is very important. Um, that will, you know, make the super attack uh, bonus attack and defense just add so much more. And we did pretty well for the first attack here. Um, he is healing, so let's just pop this. His super attack raises attack and defense as well. So I think post super, if he gets his guard, he's actually tanking quite a bit of stuff. If he gets his guard. <laughs> and you gotta have Android Cell Saga category allies on the team. Now, this isn't technically the best Android Cell Saga lineup for free to play. It's more super based than anything. So we do have an active skill with him, which can be activated if your HP is 60% or above from the third turn onwards. So let's pop this because I believe we might be able to transform in the next turn so uh this is the first time seeing it it's it, i've seen the super trunks version of it and it's exactly the same so what that active skill did was greatly raise attack ultimate damage and disables enemies action once within the turn um so maybe that was blocking the super hopefully um and then he's now at 386,000 defense which is nice high chance the guard still um let's fingers crossed we get this proc and that active skill should have been type advantage i didn't really check but we are versing cell so it should have been ost i think is actually pretty decent as well uh we'll have to float out gohan here because he's type disadvantage um this and uh andrew 16 here has that nice little uh guard chance as well it's a lot of high chance guarding units do we get it this time we do perfect uh, we are 7.2 without any of the um, Super Saiyan links, unfortunately. But still 5 million and the additional. Um, you definitely want to probably... The most optimal way to use him is obviously as a second slot unit right now. Uh, and then the, the perfect first slot unit is AGL Gohan. If you can get some decent amount of stacks in with him um, until, when the event is easy. I personally would not run double of him. Uh, just because it will make it have it so you have to have him at two different rotations, which is two times the chance of dying. Uh, I would personally run him in these many other categories that you can fit three other Android Cell Saga category allies on the team, like Hybrid Saiyan or Bond of Master Disciple, for example. Um, let's pop this active skill here. Might as well. You can use both active skills. So you might as well throw it out. And we can hear the cool OST once again. That will disable his attack, uh, which is the heal back first. This Trunks is pretty cool now that he has like a little friend um, that is somewhat red zone viable, depending on what red zone you're doing. 
And you have two other saviors on the rotation. You're versing Cell or an extreme class ally. Then you have the or extreme class enemy. You have the seeking super attack, which could help out um, a decent bit. All right. Now we get into super trunks here. Force transformation. Uh, transforms at the start of the next turn after attacking five or more times during the battle. I believe the active skill does count as well. So if you're extremely unlucky, extremely unlucky, you will take like seven turns maybe in order to get that. We do have the active skill as well. I'll probably save it just because we have a decent um, rotation here. I'm just going to grab this. I will waste though, and then I can grab this. So what changes now for his details? Obviously, the leader stays the same. His 12 key raises attack defense for one turn, immense damage to the enemy, and performs a guaranteed critical hit for one turn, which is amazing. Uh, passive skill, four key, and attack defense 300%, which is a lot. Uh, did we guard here? Yes, we did. Beautiful Android 16. 14 million guaranteed critical is insane, actually. I'm liking that. 13. Oh, my. 15. Um, performs an additional super attack guards all attacks for three turns from the first appearance. Whoa. Oh, my God. He's doing numbers, man. Holy crap. He just... I didn't even need the wings. That is insane, dude. He gets an additional attack and defense boost of up to 200%. The more HP to rain, the greater the boost. And an additional attack defense 100% when performing a super attack. Um, this is one of his better rotations. Wow, we get to see him tank too. We'll get it. We'll save it. Uh, 387,000 defense start of turn. With guard, that's reasonable uh, a super attack will you will still take damage however um and that would if you're running two of them that could be pretty bad because he gets a lot of attack defense boost depending on your hp um luckily this gohan here will boost them up so let's have a look just to see how he tanks how he fares with this stage here we still got Whis activated so i mean it's not that big of a deal i guess at the end of the day 59,000. So you would have taken like 200,000 ish. 150,000, 200,000, I'd say. And he just, he's going to obliterate this guy, or at least. <laughs> Why is he actually insane when he's in Super Trucks? You know what? I'd, I'd change my mind. I like this guy. I like this guy. Who cares about the haters that say, like, oh, he's not, he sucks. Bro, just run a Whis or something. You'll be fine. <laughs> You'll be fine. All right, so let's try his active skill here, which can be activated when an HP is 60% or above or when facing a cell enemy. So he isn't too reliant on HP when you're versing cell. 12 million critical. The fact that it's guaranteed critical too. I wish though he was tied for advantage because the only thing he's not good in... I guess you only bring him versing Cell anyway, but that's not, oh, that, I guess that's the worst part about him. Is you, you want him to be consistent. You want him to um, be facing Cell. Um, it's like when you verse the Shadow Dragons and he doesn't have that type advantage, he might actually... The damage reduction is going to affect him quite a bit. But does he like actually kill in one shot? Like one turn? He has huge numbers, man. Oh my god. Damn, bro. Kind of like, um... It gives me that, um, Incel vibes, really. High numbers, multiple additionals with critical chance. Except Cell relies on HP. While this guy relies on having more HP. And then doing an amount of attacks to transform. You know what I mean? <laughs> kind of like that vibe. Look, we get an extra turn. That is um crazy. And if you... I guess if you run two of them, you got two Ghost Ushers. Which is kind of cool. Which is very, very cool. I really do like that. Two Ghost Ushers on a 200% leader. You can have a third Ghost Usher, right? If you run Android 17 and 18. Because they're part of the category. And you're just killing there. Any um finished screen? Nah. I wish he did have a finish screen. The act, like, animations-wise is whack. Super Trunks is insane, dude. 
Uh, I'm going to wrap it up there. I hope you guys did enjoy. He thoroughly surprised me um, quite a bit, for sure. Um, hopefully, you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel with the notification bell on. Check out my social medias linked in the description. And shout us to my tier 2 members if you'd like to join. That's linked in also in the description. Until the next one, stay obvious, stay safe, stay busy. Peace out.